In this video I will show you how you can get the best FPS on Crunker for a low-end PC. But before, join if you want to get access to my memberships perks and subscribe so you can be up to date with everything I post on this channel. First you need to go here, type check, press on check for updates, here you can update your windows. Just press on check for updates and follow the steps to be up to date. Now open the game, go down here to the settings. First go to general, press here on performance. Then go to display. On the UL scale, select one, and check this. Show UL, select on, use old scoreboard, select off. Disable rarity animations, select off. Show profile pictures, select off. Dynamic HP bars, select off. Show hit indicators, select off. Show damage, select off. Damage scale, select one. Show kill feed, select off. Show kill counter, select off. Show death counter, select off. Show K slash D counter, select off. Show score counter, select off. Show streak counter, select off. Show ping, select on. Show FPS, select on. Show movement speed, select off. Speed X offset, select 5. Speed Y offset, select 5.4. Speed scale, select 2.4. Speed opacity, select 1. Show metals, select off. Nematog opacity, select 1. Nematog health number, select off. XP bar opacity, select 1. Hide non-tradable skins, select off. Then go here to render. Scroll up. On the resolution, select 0.5. Frame cap, select 0. Aspect ratio, select percents. Anti-aliasing, select off. Low specs, select on. No textures, select on. Map details, select off. Particles, select off. Particle distance, select 10. Render distance, select 100. Reflection quality, select map dependent. Shadows, select off. Soft shadows, select off. High res shadows, select off. Dynamic shadows, select off. Ambient shading, select zero. Old shading, select off. Bullet trails, select off. Your trails, select off. Muzzle flash, select off. Show sniper flap, select off. Sniper flap animation, select off. Texture animations, select off. Object animations, select off. Screen shake, select off. Weapons shine, select off. Lighting, select low. Show explosions, select off. And on the post processing, select off. Quit the settings, close the game. Now you need to have the ultimate performance guide on your PC, so go here, type CMD, right click on command prompt, and press on run as an administrator. Then this page will pop up, here you have to paste a command, copy this command from my description, and just right click and paste it here, then press enter, and now you have the ultimate performance guide, but to activate it, you need to close the page, then go here, type choose. Press on choose a power plan. Then you have to press on this arrow. Scroll all the way down, check ultimate performance and now you have it activated. Go here, type this PC. Right click on it, press on properties. Here you have to go to advanced system settings. This page will pop up, on the advanced, under performance, press on settings. Here you have to check adjust for best performance. Then press apply. OK. OK again. Close the page. Go here, type graphics. Press on graphics settings. Make sure you have this on. Then press here on browse. Search where you have your Steam folder. Double click on it. Go to Steam apps. Then common. Crunker. And this is the right file you need to find. First right click on it, press on properties. Here you have to go to compatibility, check disable full screen optimization. Then go here to change high DPI settings. Check this box. Then press OK, press apply. OK. Then select it, press here on add. When you have this here, 
Press on Options. Here check High Performance. Press on Save. Go back here to Settings Home. Go to Gaming. On the Xbox Game Bar, select this to Off. Then on the Game Mode, select this to On, for the optimization from graphics settings to work. Now right click on the screen, press on NVIDIA Control Panel. This page will pop up, go to Adjust Image Settings with Preview, check Use the Advanced 3D Image Settings, press Apply, then go here to Manage 3D Settings. Here we have to change some settings, open GL Rendering GPU, select your video card, Power Management Mode, select Prefer Maximum Performance, Texture Filtering Quality, select High Performance, Threaded Optimization, select On, and Vertical Sync, select Off. Press on Apply, then go here to adjust desktop color settings. Scroll down to Digital Vibrance. Move this to 70%. Press Apply. Close the page, and now enjoy the game.